Okay. So while Jahir is off being uh, the party scout, Carrot would probably be uh, schmoozing it up with Dinah here, trying to to grow the relationship a little bit. I mean, he does. He is uh, falling in love with her, and uh, you know that's not something he's actually done before. I mean, he's a very committed and thoughtful young man who uh, would place most of his time and energy on his studies rather than on women. And uh, Dinah here, being uh, equally academic, just excited his passions, and uh, yeah, now instead of uh, constantly reading or researching, now uh, he can see why it's worthwhile to actually take a little time to, to socialize. And of course, being uh, as old-fashioned as he is, He's probably going to think about popping the big question if the relationship gets serious enough. I mean, it really all depends on where it goes. Either way, he's just kind of happy right now because, I don't know, he actually has someone who uh, he loves and someone who thinks, uh, rather, he thinks that he's she's falling in love with him. Wow, look at that. Damn. Six spiders. I think some of them are sword. Dangerous. Let's see. Wraith spider? Sword spider? Hmm. Well, let's see. We probably have to roll knowledge arcane checks to see what Carrot would know about that. But what I know about it as a player is that wraith spiders are uh, actually. Hmm. One utter cap, six. Um, Tesloy. What he would know about that is that Wraith... Well, I, what I would know, Carrot would probably know it too, is that uh, Wraith Spiders can only be harmed by magical weapons, and Sword Spiders, well, while they can be harmed with mundane weapons, they are actually uh, incredibly fast and dangerous. And uh, obviously something... Six more Tesloy that the party should be aware of and cautious around definitely would make sense to try to actually ambush a lot of these monsters to get rid of them. Just considering uh, how much of a threat they are. Oh, okay. Are you spiders? Goodness, there's a lot of monsters and encounters in here. This area of the wilderness is busy. Oh, crap, it's a trap. Run, Jahira, run! Oh, crap, Jahira is held. And hopefully her is invisibility did not disappear. Maybe she'll make her save from the web trap? Eh? Well, at least we know to expect web traps. Expect web traps. There we go. Aw, oh, crap, she made her save, but I didn't take the opportunity to get her to run out. You can do it, Jahira! God, web is so powerful in this game. It's like a mass hold person spell, where you make a save every round. I mean, hold person, you make one save and you're kaput. But still, I mean, it takes up a huge area. As we've seen, when uh, spiders used web traps to uh, kill Khalid and Minsk in the Cloakwood Forest, which was obviously no fun. Finally, the web trap fades. Oh, and it looks like she is still invisible, so that's good. Apparently, the web spell didn't cancel that. Three more spiders. Oh, sheesh. Jahira is certainly going to have a lot to report back about. Just going to get back to camp and be like, Well, I found about two dozen groups of monsters. Uh, yeah, do we really have any reason to go about trying to kill them? I mean, they really don't have any treasure. <laughs> and, uh, you know, it does take effort, time, and obviously risk to uh, attack dangerous monsters. I don't know, would it really make sense? So Jahira would actually give back to the party and report on what she saw. Alright. Kira definitely would want to talk to the Red Wizards of Thay and this elf. Um, spiders, and Tazloy. So it's really all spiders, Edricaps, Tazloy. It's pretty much most of what are here. Now, Tazloy are very dangerous. And he would want to get rid of them. The spiders and the edder caps, I mean, they're more natural creatures and actually belong in this kind of environment. But, uh, 
Yeah, they're also a problem as well. And Carrot is thinking if the party's going to be out here in the wilderness, that, uh, you know, they might as well get rid of these threats to travelers. I mean, uh, obviously this isn't a main trade route, but he would argue that attacking the enemies where they are is how you keep them away from the trade routes. And so this is how he would uh, justify actually taking aggressive acts against the monsters out here. So, and I'm sure the rest of the party would make arguments as well, but, you know, this is in a let's place analyzing the stock NBCs, but... Yes, O oh, omnipresent authority figure. Rather, what Carrot has to say about all of it, so... Okay. Servant awaits. Let's uh, get rid of this Tazloy up here. Actually, we're gonna keep we're gonna keep uh, Jahira invisible over here. Weapon unusable. Oh, he just ran out of bullets. I'm gone. Alright, well they're dealt with. Okay. Delete. Alright, now I guess we could... Hmm. It actually might, might, might make more sense if we get rid of the other caps over here. Come along, get rid of the spiders, and then approach the red wizards. But then again, she said the, the walkway up to where they are is right here. So it would make sense to approach from that direction. Which I guess is what the party will do. Alright, they'll hide on the other okay, side of don't. these trees. And uh, they're red wizards of Thay by the looks of it. And uh, they obviously can't be trusted. So, Carrot is going to say the for the party to actually prepare for a potential confrontation with them. So how can they do that? Well, Carrot is going to cast armor on himself. I suppose, uh, Dine here will cast Mirror Image, and so will Carrot. And I guess that's enough. Party will advance and, uh, see what these Red Wizards have to say. Hopefully they won't be hostile. Fear my wrath, for it is great indeed. It is so sad to have met you this fine day. Normally we would be quite ecstatic to have visitors, but in these troubled times we really do desire privacy. We just can't afford to have anyone knowing that we're here. That is why you must die. Carrot would kind of be off-put by this, and uh, he just wanted to talk to them. I know why they have to be hostile. He would say, uh, just wait a moment, we won't bother you. Just let us go on our way, and you'll never see us again. Sorry, but the Red Wizards of Thay are known for their, not known for their magnanimous nature. We're going to have to kill you. Dine here says, beware, Carrot. If those art indeed the Red Wizards of Thay, the truth of which have I have no reasons to doubt, they art as skilled in arts arcane as, thy, as they art devious. Tanakh says, This accent is all too familiar. You must be the Rashemi, witch spotted in these parts by our friends. I can see that Edwin did not carry out his mission as ordered. La Sala, I suggest that we, do, we were not to tell them, tell him that we are done, that we have done his job. The farther away he is, the less abstractions he creates for us. And they become hostile. And uh, the two wizards are actually behind him. So, Carrot is going to even the fight by hasting the party. Dine here will cast Fireball right in the midst of them. Imowen will shoot magical arrows at this chap here. Uh, Minsk will charge. Khalid will also charge. And uh, Jahira will... What is this potion? Potion of explosions? She will also use a potion of explosions right into the middle of them. And, uh... Alright, here we go. Combat begins. 
All right, explosions go off. One and two. All right. That kills the two wizards behind him, only this Dinak guy is still standing. Let's get rid of him. Alright, the party is feared. Okay. Tiny, uh, let's see, Jahira is going to cast Dispel Magic. Everyone finishes him off with a bow. Uh, okay, dispels the effects. Minsk is still panicked. Oh, okay, he got his senses. Oh, apparently there was actually a fourth wizard. Hmm. Well, they're all dead now. Okay, Khalid would go about uh, looting the bodies of the red wizards. Okay, uh, I suppose Minsk will take the scrolls, because that doesn't make any sense, considering uh, Minsk doesn't probably doesn't even know how to read. Well, maybe he does. 